What's happening guys? Welcome back to another episode. Today we're at the dyno and we have a customer's Porsche 911 Targa 4 GTS getting ready to get uh, APR tune done. Uh, we're gonna get the four numbers uh, and then flash everything over and do some polls to see what it makes. So right now we're getting the dyno set up. We just got it uh, separated to its distance that we needed and uh, it is all-wheel drive. This car's only mods that we've done are uh, downpipes, so should rip. These things are extremely fun. Uh, we did do the ECU and TCU tune, so the PDK transmission should be flying after this. So definitely uh, be cool to see what it picks up. We're going to do some baselines here in a minute, but we just got the shop all cleaned up. The floors are sealed. Ryan and the guys busted some tail here to get this stuff cleaned up. We have a dyno day, May 4th, and open house between both shops. So if you're local in the area, definitely stop by and check us out. We're gonna have cars ripping over here. We're gonna have car show over there. We got vendors showing up. We got food truck coming. It's gonna be pretty awesome. Uh, oh yeah, we got a local radio station, 97 Rock. Coming here, Shred is gonna be out here, I think, with the the 97 Rock bus. Uh, it's gonna be pretty cool. But yeah, we got a couple things going. We just finished a Whipple F-150 back there. Um, we're just waiting uh, for his dyno appointment and he'll be ready to rock. RX-8 over there, LS3 swap to BMW over there. That's gotta get some tuning and some other adjustments made. But yeah, we're gonna get rocking and rolling on this. Just wanna bring you guys along for the ride and uh, get things going. This, this shop's coming along very, very nicely. We're gonna get the lounge uh, starting to rock and roll up here. So when you're over here getting the cartoon, you can sit up in the lounge and enjoy the view and watch cars rip. But uh, get this thing loaded on the dyno and see what it does. Let's go. So we're getting the dyno all set up. Uh, one thing that we do that we are getting improvements on are uh, fans. So we have the air mover here and the other fan there. We actually have uh, 4,000 CFM, like one of those like turbo looking air, air movers on the way. Um, that'll be here soon. Um, and then we're also gonna be getting uh, two 2,000 CFM fans. And I think we're actually gonna mount them uh, on a post on these four here and have it so it can face down on regular engine bays, but we're gonna keep that 4,000 mobile so that on rear engine cars, stuff like that, we can move that around and have airflow. Um, obviously airflow is super important, but you know, as the, as it's been winter time and stuff like that, it's been very cool in here and outside. So we, it's been cool enough to, you know, operate and we've had enough air movement. So 
Um, definitely more fans on the way. And uh, we're about to get rocking. We just got this thing strapped down and we're getting ready to go. So we're just gonna get baseline numbers on this, see where it's at right now. Down pipes are already on the car and then uh, we'll get the tune on it and see what we're making. Alright, we are hooked in and on the line with uh, APR right now, getting uh, everything ready to go. This is getting an ECU and PDK tune. Very excited to see what it does.
Not bad. Four base run was four like four hundred and actually one of them was like three eighty-eight uh, horsepower. This made four sixty-six and four ninety-three torque. Not bad. That's not bad at all. Not bad at all. Alright, so Dino, little success action. APR tune on the Porsche was pretty pretty nice, dude. I mean, uh, baseline poles, it made 388 and about 400, depending on heat soap, I would assume. Um, so we netted, it made 466, and I don't remember torque. It's in the video. You guys saw it, but I can't remember. I'll put it up on the screen. But uh, it netted some pretty good power just for a, basically a stage one flash. Yeah. So pretty impressive. I think, uh, think he'll be happy with it. He'll be picking up here in a little bit here. And uh, I think he'll be pretty impressed with it. Yep, get the undershields back on and all that good to go. He's gonna pull it in, right? Zach, they got stuff on the, the rack right now. Uh, but yeah, so pretty sweet. Gonna keep rocking and rolling out here. We just wanted to bring you guys along for a little dyno action on the uh, Targa 4 GTS. That'll do it for this one. We'll catch you on the next video. Stay tuned, check us out on Instagram, Facebook. Be the first to know what's going on with events, where we're going to be at, and we'll catch you on the next one. Peace.